Back in the day, McCarthy really was the quintessential Sin City. There was moonshining and gambling and prostitution. There's not prostitution today. Uh, they make it legal. I'll probably do something about it. I can always use another business uh, interest. My name's Neil Darish, and I own most of the businesses here in town. McCarthy is so remote that people here have to be self-sufficient for everything Mother Nature can't provide. They have only one man they can turn to. People are going to go shopping. It's in my store. If they're going to eat in this town, it's going to be with me. I've got a grocery store down the street that has a hardware store in it. I've got a hotel. And I have this old historic saloon, and it's the only bar for a miles in any direction. OK, get going on this stuff. Known locally as the unofficial mayor of McCarthy, Neil hires a supply plane once a month to stock up, selling it all to locals for a price. Hey, Neil. How many you need? Uh, this should be good in the crew right now. When I first came out here, man, I fell in love with this place. It just was magic. But before I got here, you couldn't rely on anything. You couldn't buy a cold beer. I saw an opportunity, you know, to take this third world shanty town, bring it to first world, to clean it up, to get rid of the edges. That's my goal. If Neil had his way, he might make McCarthy a very different place. 40 below out, leave the door open. And I definitely can't say I support that. Neil's been in the Valley for a long time. Of the 30 buildings in McCarthy, he owns about half of them. He is business. Neil is kind of a pure capitalist type guy. He wants a town full of people and cars and you know giant lodges and all kinds of stuff. But at what cost? 